I'm James Sabalski, along with Ray Ferraro. We are so looking forward to the action in this one tonight. Let's send it down to Ray Ferraro, who is between both benches ringside, Ray. I want to see tonight, James, who's going to be able to take care of the puck. Both teams have been plagued by turnovers of late. They turn the puck over, they make themselves defend way more often than need be. The officials there at center, and I think we are about to get this one underway. Oh, I've been waiting for this all day, and we are now officially underway. Battle along the boards. Boston's got a hold of it along the wall. Pokes it away in his own end. Orlando's looking to break out of their own end. Handles the pass from the right wing. Takes the puck at the point. Great defensive effort with the stick. That's blocked. JC's moving the puck through his own zone. Boston's on the attack. Grabs the puck here inside the offensive end. And that's broken up. Jordan's taking it from his own end. And he serves it across to Farmer. Intercepts it in the neutral zone. Slides it on over to Payne. Nice zone entry on the left side. Makes a move in front. And a strong effort on that play. Moves the puck along the half wall. And he totally whiffs on that one. Couldn't complete the play. Centering pass. And that's picked off in front. Horvat's got it across the line. Jabs the puck away. Here he is from the slot. And the shot dies in the traffic jam. Another stop by the goaltender. Quick reflexes. You make one, you make two stops before the puck is cleared away. We haven't even hit the midway mark of the period. We're still scoreless. The Whalers take possession off the faceoff. Let's it fly, and he comes up with it. The centermen glide into position. Offense's own faceoff, and he wins the draw. Jostling for the puck, and he loses control. Ahead of steam now towards the front. Centering pass. What a save. He'll probably feel that one tomorrow. Play resumes here as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. Orlando's ready to go on the attack. Just misses. You kick yourself in the tail after you miss a chance like this. Has to be on the net. And a nice poke check inside the neutral zone. Picked up along the wall by Brian. Orlando's got a hold of the puck. The Solar Bears take it across the blue line. Boston's got the puck along the boards. Grabbed along the boards by Days. Inside his own end moves the puck. Boston's got a hold of it against the wall. Days has it in the defensive end. And a stick in the lane ends that threat. They gain the offensive zone from the middle. Orlando's got the puck in the defensive end. And now he tries to get it across to Hearns. Moves the puck. An easy save by Cole. More than half the period has expired. Still no score in this one. Back underway as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. Edom's got it now deep inside his own end. They fight for it along the boards. Kind of lost control for a second there, but regains possession. The Whalers take possession in the defensive end. Moves it to Payne. Oh, the referee's gonna call that one. There goes the whistle. No extra attacker able to get there in time. The Whalers will serve two for slashing. Rarely is a slashing penalty considered a good penalty to take. Orlando.
Orlando sending their power play unit out for the first time tonight. Their first power play of the game. The game is scoreless, and now they'll start offensive zone faceoff, move the puck around, puts it in for the power play goal! I made a living on the power play, and you can tell early in a power play if it's going to be any good or not. If you're scrambling all over, it's not going to go that two minutes. This one worked perfectly. He got clear in the low slot, found where the opening was, and takes that pass to one time it past the goalie. Orlando's play finally pays off here with a goal just past the midway mark of the first. Well, you got the lead. Don't sit back now. This is the time to be aggressive. Go get another one. From center, they get into the attacking area. Excellent stick work on the play. And he slides it quickly to Payne. Oh, what a missed chance that was. Yeah, he's got to make a better play there. He's done everything right. Now you just got to get the puck on the tape. Boston's got it in their own zone. The Whalers take it along the wall. Stays with it. Let's it fly. And he makes the save. He scores! Now you gotta keep clawing back. Trailing in the game, they get the equalizer. Goalie just can't keep up with this. He's close to the net, but he's still able to have enough room to beat the goaltender. Here in the later stages of this period, we got a tie game. Horvath's one possession. Scored by number 18, assisted by number 15, and by number 66. Orlando's got the puck along the wall. From the right side, moves it up ahead. Tape to tape feed on the blue line. Orlando's on the attack. Takes a shot, and that one stopped. In the, first period. the Solar Bears have it in the offensive zone. Passes right to the front. Whiffs on that. Quick pass to chase on. Oh, they telegraph the pass, and he picks it off. Here he is in close. There's the go-ahead goal, and we have a new game. Taking the lead now, you control it. You push the pace. You push the other guys back on their heels. He's probably got about two seconds from the time that puck's delivered to find it. He can't see it, so he drops into the butterfly and hopes it hits him. The Whalers get a little breathing room here as they lead by one in the first. They talked about getting off to a good start in the first period. Now that they've got the lead, they'll want to build off it. That's the horn, and period number one comes to an end after a very entertaining 20 minutes. With hot food and ice cold beverages, now's your chance to join us at one of our many concession stands located throughout the stadium. Second period still to come. We'll take a quick pause and be right back with more action. Well, let's see what period two has in store for us as they are about to drop the puck. Boston's won the draw, and now it's grabbed by Johns. Couldn't complete the play, and tries to make a diagonal pass to Horvat. Move to the middle, finds nothing but air on that shot. The Solar Bears scoop it up along the boards. Straight up the middle, here they come. Battling for it along the boards. Nice stick work to knock the puck loose. Moves it quickly over to Ma. Couldn't connect on that pass. Puck scooped up by Horvat. And he'll retreat inside his own end. Carrying the puck deep inside his own end. And he'll take a step back here deep inside his own zone. 
Gaining momentum along the boards. Here's the shot, and that caroms right off the mask. The Solar Bears get a hold of the puck along the boards. Pokes it away to keep the pressure on. They try to maintain possession inside the defensive zone. Farmer's feeling that, and someone's going to the box. They're looking to make something happen through the neutral zone now. Hangs onto the puck. Here he is, shot right in front. Oh, some fans thought that was in, but that went off the side of the net. Time for the official to pass down his sentence. They're calling slashing on the play, Ray. Penalty of frustration in a lot of cases. Back to the face-off circle. They'll send the man advantage unit out again. Well, this power play shows up at a rather opportune time. They're trailing by one, and now a chance to level the score off. Aggression will be the key for them. Drives it to the crease. Misses. That fell on his stick like a platter, and he still cued it wide. Takes the puck as the clock ticks down on the penalty kill. Gets it out of his own end. Orlando's gained possession along the boards. Here they come. Slides it across. Let's it go. Oh, he stops it with a glove. Great reflexes there. Still lots of time left here in this frame. It's 2-1. Good job tangling up his opponent here. Orlando's trying to make something happen in the offensive zone. Shot! Oh, you can't miss that. Now, somehow I got 408, James. And he scores! Putting the special in special teams tonight. Now, the extra work they've done, the way that they've moved some people around, has helped them cash in more than once on the power play. when we get one of these. I think I had one in 18 years. Officials getting ready to drop the puck. Puck possession so key in today's game. Boston's won it. Puck grabbed by Dunn. Here's a short pass to JC. Hammers a shot. Takes that one right in the logo. And the referee has blown his whistle, bringing a stop to the play. Boston's won the draw, and they'll go to work. Taken by Horvath. Trying to get back on the attack now. Puck picked up by Moore. Picking up momentum inside the neutral zone. Now a quick pass to Shepard. Sends it across. Stopped with ease. Sets up from Gretzky's office. Wrists one. Oh, and comes up with nothing on the play. Most dangerous place on the ice, and he can't capitalize. He scores, and the deadlock's been broken. Now you get a chance to control the pace of the game. It's tough to do it in a tie game. Now you've got the lead. I don't think the goaltender gets a look at this at all, James. He just drops into the butterfly. He's hoping the thing hits him through that trap. here in this second period pretty important goal to get to break the tie here as you get into the middle frame and now you have a chance to Four control by maybe the way the game's played by number 31 and by number grabs it in his own end 10 minutes 48 seconds takes the feed ahead from the left side looking to make something happen in the offensive zone the whalers gain possession along the wall exploring options here inside the defensive zone from along the walls, they're gaining momentum. Quick feed to Wang. 
Oh, and he can fake his stick for that one. Gives him a tap with the stick, and the referees don't like it. Here comes the call. And they're going to be shorthanded as slashing is the call on the play. Yeah, this is a penalty of frustration, James. He things haven't been going his way. He reacts and gets called. Now puts his team shorthanded. The Solar Bears send their man advantage unit out once more. At the morning skate today, they were really working on the power play quite extensively. The power play coach has to be satisfied with how they've looked tonight. And he denied that opportunity. Puck moved back to the neutral zone. Orlando's got control of it now from their own end. Nice pass. All smart heads up play to poke that one away. With the steal. Farmer's been whacked on the play. The official's arm is up in the air. You call that a hatchet job with that slash? I call that chopping broccoli right there, James. <laughs> Very good reference. A five-on-three with plenty of time to work with here coming up. Five-on-three can really change the game. Tip it on its head by getting a couple goals on a rather lengthy power play. Trying to come up with a huge defensive play to get this puck out of his own end. Past the midway mark of the frame, Orlando's got a 3-2 lead at this point. They take possession as he locks them up off the faceoff. Orlando's got a hold of it along the wall. And he regains control of the puck. Chason's picking up steam. Big play inside the defensive zone. Here's a chance right out in front. Denied by the goaltender. Trying to dump it out. And it's a small victory for the PK unit here. Well, that's their job. Get it down the ice, get off the ice, get some new people out there. Orlando's got it in the offensive zone. Good defensive stop with the poke check. Boston's going to be able to kill a few seconds off now with the puck. One last gas to make something happen on this power play. Through center along the wing. Nice dish from the left wing. Good defensive effort to poke it away. A strong penalty killing performance on that one as both teams are now back to even strength. Oh, when the puck moves and the feet don't, this is what you get. You have lots of zone time, but no real dangerous chances on that power play. In the final moments of this period, Orlando's hanging on to this 3-2 lead. Denies him! He got all of it! The Solar Bears continue to lead here in the late stages of this second period. Chase on, won the draw. Takes control of the puck. Turns it away. There's another stop. Sometimes you're in close. There's no room to put it anywhere. The goalie smothered it all. Deflected away. Nice defensive use of the stick there. And a poke check knocks the puck away. There's the whistle stopping the play. Officials making the call. You know, you had, what, over 400 goals? Different kind of stick work here. A little different. I, I would say this is probably the penalty I took as much as any. Really? Yeah, you get a little <laughs> bit behind and... Or you get a little bit frustrated and the slash is the one. Or is that the Ferraro temper? No, it's... Yes. <laughs> and a solid job tying up his opponent. Grabs the puck here in their own end. And manages to clear the zone. The Solar Bears have it behind the cage. With some open space at center. Here's the pass. Snaps it on net. Makes the save as he gets a piece of it with the glove. Cole scores! The power play had cashed in earlier. They do so again here. Really nice effort with the extra man. No way sometimes for the goalie to catch up to the pass. It's too quick. It's one-timed into the net. Orlando's 
giving themselves a little breathing room here late in the second. I would say the next couple of minutes before we get to the intermission are really vital. You'd like to go in just in the spot you're in right now. By number 19. On the attack along the boards. And by number 51. Time of the goal. Right in the slot. Here's a shot and makes the save. Wang's taking a nasty whack, and that's going to draw a penalty. And here's the official call as play is whistled dead. Slashing the call and a pretty dangerous one at that. That's way too big a swing to get away with. He's going to go to the box. The Whalers will have a chance to get on the power play for the first time this evening. Off the draw, and he ties up his opponent. Time of the penalty, 19 minutes, 50 seconds. Still anyone's game, especially the way these two teams have been producing offensively as the second period comes to an end. It's time to support those around us with our monthly food drop. Bring three non-perishable food items, and you can receive a free team poster. What's in store for the third period? Let's tune in to find out just moments away. Welcome back, everyone. Both teams lined up at center ice, and we are ready to get this third period underway. Orlando's shorthanded unit gets off to a good start. They win the draw and take early possession. The Whalers gain control of the puck against the wall. Wang's moving it ahead. Aaron pass, and the play's broken up. And they get some breathing room as the puck leaves the defensive end. The Whalers have it against the wall. Angles it over to Days. Takes the feed in the middle of the neutral zone. Grabs the puck at center. Settles things down and gets control of it once again. And he easily stops that one. Kim's getting bailed out by his team tonight. He's not had a good night. His save percentage is poor. The Solar Bears lead this one early in the third period. They have been the more aggressive team offensively with the lead in the shot department. Moore's won the draw deep in the defensive zone. And the puck is moved to a safer spot on the ice. Boston's got a hold of it against the wall. They're picking up steam through the neutral zone. And time expires on the power play. Both teams back to even. Well, back to even strike. The penalty killers do a really good job. They retain their lead on the backs of those four guys. Still early on in this frame, James and Ray with you. So glad you could join us. Lots of offense here tonight. 4-2 is where we're sitting. Boston's won the draw. And now it's grabbed by Blake. From in close. Way too much congestion blocks that. Orlando's got it along the wall. Moves it to Shepard. Good heads-up play in the defensive zone. Carries the puck up through center. Orlando's ready to go on the attack. Broken up at center. Along the half wall with the puck. Here's a chance on the doorstep. And that one's broken up. Pokes it away to stay on the attack. Orlando's got the puck now. Moore's got it against the boards. Drives to the sweet spot. Wide of the net. Oh, man, he's frustrated with himself. He's got to get that on the net. No one home on that play. Puts the puck on net. Uh-uh. Nice block. Boston's got the puck along the boards. And now he moves it quickly to Alexis. The Whalers play it along the wing. Misses over the net. Orlando's got the puck. Nice poke check inside the attacking zone. Boston's got the puck along the wall. Quick pass over to Blake. Takes the feed. Throws it in. Orlando's gained possession along the boards. Through the neutral zone now, picking up steam. 
From the point, they take control of it. Can't catch up to the pass. Boston's got it against the boards. Manages to hang on. Back at the point, they set it up. And that shot gets caught in traffic. Puck battle along the boards. The Whalers gain possession along the wall. A chance from the slot. Stones him in front. Yeah, he gets out on top of the shooter. There's really nowhere for that puck to go. Kim's not had many shots, but he makes an excellent save there to keep the game close. Orlando's been the better team tonight. They have turned good defense into solid offense, and they lead here in the third. Boston's got it in the offensive zone. Stopped by the goaltender. Boston's got it from behind the net. Handles it along the blue line. Too much traffic in the lane. JC's got it along the boards. Orlando's looking to break out. And the puck's kicked free. Sends a pass over. Knocks the puck away in the open ice. Maintains possession. And now it's over to Farmer. Orlando's got it in their own zone. And now he angles it across to Payne. The Whalers will play it from the defensive zone. Horvat's got it along the boards. Quick pass to JC. Denied by the defender. Rips it from the blue line. Stopped by the goaltender. Orlando's not far from the finish line here as they lead it late in this third. Boston's won the faceoff. Centering pass! Here's a chance, and that's blocked! And pokes the puck loose inside the offensive end. In front, and a stoppage on the play as the goaltender covers things up. This is a faceoff. They'll definitely want to win here inside the offensive zone. Chase Suns won it in their own end. Keeps hold of the puck. Orlando's across the blue line. Picked up along the boards by Days. Boston's got the puck along the wall. Takes it into the slot. Orlando's got the puck in their own end. Shepard's gaining momentum. In the third period. And as he stumbles, he coughs up the puck. Moves it quickly over to Crosby. Boston's got a hold of the puck. Scrum ensues along the boards. Pokes it away to keep the pressure on. Almost lost the puck, but hangs on here as play continues. Big save. Oh, he had to get up tight to the puck. In close, he takes away any room. Trying to get back on the attack now. Puck scooped up by Moore. And the lane's clogged up, blocking that. Boston's in now. Snaps one here in the slot. Oh, he'll feel that one. Boston's trailing. That's why they've got the extra attacker out on the ice and the goalie on the bench. And the puck stopper tags his man to get the extra attacker on the ice. Penalty coming up here as the play is stopped. The Whalers are being called for tripping. His stick gets in between his feet, and when the player goes down, the penalty's going to be called. The Solar Bears once again send out their power play unit. And momentum on their side as they win the draw here inside the offensive zone. And too much traffic in front blocks that one. Great reflexes, another save. Stop one, stop two. The goalie makes a couple of excellent saves. Those are the saves that are gifts from the goaltender. That looked like an automatic goal. He's able to make the stop. Orlando's been the better team offensively tonight. A lot of scoring chances, and they lead it late in this third period. Nice start winning the draw here inside the offensive zone. And that's blocked. And that'll do it from ringside here. They peppered the other goaltender, had more shots on goal, and 
in the end, even in a close game, that becomes part of the difference. Well, at some point in time, you take enough opportunities, you're bound to convert in theory, right? Well, that's that's the basic goal. logic, anyway. Yeah. Eventually, they get the puck into the net enough times to win. For Ray Ferraro, my name is James Sabalski. Thanks so much for joining us, everybody. Have a great night.